Hi guys, welcome to Algorithms Made Easy. Today we will go through the day 4 problem from August Lead Coding Challenge, Power of 4. Please like the video and if you are new, don't forget to subscribe to our channel so that you never miss any update. Given an integer, write a function to check whether it is a power of 4. Thus, for 16 the result is true and for 5 the result becomes false. There is a follow up to it. Can you solve it without using loop or recursion? We will see various approaches starting from brute force that uses a loop, mathematical and bit malimulation. Starting with the naive one. Let's take example as 16. As we need to find power of 4, we will keep on dividing the number by 4 and check the remainder. In first iteration, number mod 4 is 0, so we divide the number by 4. In the second iteration, 4 mod 4 is still 0, so we divide the number further and thus the number becomes 1. In the third iteration, 1 mod 4 is not 0, so we do not reduce the number. And check if the number is 1. As it is, we return true. Here's the algorithm of what we discussed. If number is 0, we return false. Else, we loop while number mod 4 is 0 and reduce the number to number divided by 4. At the end, if the number left is 1, we return true, else we return false. The time complexity for this approach is O of log n while the space complexity is O of 1. Here's the actual code snippet for the method. Let's go through the mathematical approach. Here's the derivation for finding of what power the number is of 4. In example, we can see that if x is a whole number, the number would be exact power of 4, while if the number is not the exact power of 4, the value of x will not be a whole number. We can use this property to find if the number is power of 4. The algorithm is exactly what we just said now. If log of number divided by log of 4 is a whole number, return true, else return false. The time and space complexity of this approach is O of 1. Here's the actual code snippet for the method. Let's go through the third approach, the bit manipulation. If we write down the numbers in binary representation, we see that power of 4 consists of only one set bit. So, if we see for 8 bits, we can have 1s in these bits. The hex value of this is 55. Now, if we jot down all the conditions, we see that for a 32-bit integer, we may have 1s at the hex equivalent shown. So, if we perform an AND operation on this value with number, it should be greater than 1. Also, we can only have one set bit which can be found by performing an AND operation of number with number minus 1. We have seen this while solving power of 2 problem. You can check out the detailed explanation behind this condition in that video. The link to it is in the top. Summing it up, the algorithm will look like this. The time and space complexity for this approach is O of 1. Here's the actual code snippet for this method. You can also check out the link to all the codes in the description below. Thanks for watching the video. Please like, share and subscribe to the channel. Also let me know in the comments what you think about the video.